Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Hope you have a wonderful day. In this video, we're going to talk about um, high interest saving account. Are you really making money and can beat the inflation if you put money in saving? So we have all saying, 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 if you put your money underneath your pillow, you actually is losing money mm -hmm. because of inflation. So that's why people are saying you should put your money in a high interest earning account to earn interest to beat the inflation. Is it true? It sounded good though. Like at the current stage when we're uh, recording this on an average high interest saving account, it's roughly about 5.1. Yeah, let's let's say 5%. In. Yeah, okay, let's assume. No, I think it's more than 5. Our inflation, I think, is 4, 5%. Where's my bank? I'm sorry. So, um, mm. it, pretty much like if you're earning an interest of about 4 to 5% from the bank, mm -hmm. you're technically covered. Covered? Are you? Uh, are you yeah. covered? Are you covered? So, 5.1%. From... See? 5.1%, my high interest earning online account. So I like I thought that I beat it. See, I put my money in the in the bank, I'm making 5.1% a year. Inflation 5%, I'm covered. Is but in the meantime, the bank's actually um, sending our money with a credit card roughly about 20%. So anyway, anyway that's just <laughs> That's how they're doing business. Is are they winning? Of course, they're, of course winning. they're winning. Anyway, are we beating the inflation because we're putting money on this account? No, no. <laughs> Works out not. It was like, oh, okay. Why is that? Mm. In order for you to earn that five percent, how much so, did you actually get? Now, how do you actually expect to get them? You got the money from from the bank right let's no let's assume that you work full time yeah yeah okay. you, you, majority of the people work full time so we're just talking us okay, okay. you work full time i work full time average people in australia paying 34 percent. i don't know roughly that, about 30 percent minimum yeah. like not minimum but On majority average. yeah 30 percent or more so 30 percent is our tax rate in australia so, so you have your personal income our income is this amount and we pay tax. We pay tax first. Of Extra 30%. income you earn on top. So if you make more money, then your yep. your yeah, your interest tax. going to pay in a higher tax bracket. Anyway, I'm poor, so I'm here, <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm paying let's say thirty percent. Right. Here. So in order, let's say, um, for is it uh, on a typical numbers? Yeah. Let's say if you earn. How much? Less. It doesn't matter how much I earn. Like okay. you mean the bank? No, no, the interest. For example, in order for you to have one thousand dollars, one thousand um, dollars. Let's say in a pay. Okay, one thousand dollars for yeah. the interest. No, no. Um, as a as an income, let's assume that you get paid is a thousand dollars. You are technically getting taxed. Let's say thirty percent. Yeah. So technically, you are after tax dollars in your bank. Uh, yeah. After it, all the admin. It's roughly mm, $700. $700 or so. It's just very simple math. Yeah. We're not taking the correct marginal tax. Correct. But that's what, what Ron is trying to say. So if you make, um, because they they calculate our tax for our personal income for tax first, and then the interest on top of it. Let's say if you're making 5000 for the year of your tax, okay, you, yeah. sorry, you got 5000 of your interest that's a lot of money right five thousand as interest anyway but then you paying thirty percent of it uh minus thirty percent so, so you're one paying and one and a half thousand back to the government so what you left out is three thousand five hundred so three thousand five hundred divided by Please. five thousand uh, yeah 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 that's yeah. like that so okay. after that which means you're making around three point five percent only mm -hmm. And you get accounted that that's your after tax dollars. So pretty much the government have a little bit of cut. Mm -hmm. Inflation probably just break even. I think that's the reason why they give you the high, high interest, interest saving account. It's like, well, inflation is actually at about 5%, 4%. Yep. <laughs> so yeah. we're going to send those money out. Pretty much. So you just pretty much break even. Yep. So you're, you're Purchasing power um, is about the same. 
later on. It looks like you're earning money, but mm. if, you know, for example, today, how much was petrol today? We I didn't stopped? check. Did you check? I didn't <laughs> check. I didn't check. No, right. we don't care anymore because we don't pay petrol. <laughs> but, uh, we drive an electric vehicle for that reason. Mm -hmm. Like, okay, then, and let's say, uh, uh, a low, actually, I no. Think it's been down like a dollar sixty or dollar seventy. So let, let's look at carrots because I realized like a bag of carrots. Um, last time I actually looked at the price mm -hmm. back when uh, a, a few, few years, years back, ago, like it was dollar. like a dollar for a, a bag a of kilo. one kilo carrots. Now yep. it's how much is it? Three dollars? No, two dollar maybe. Two. Yeah, Double. so it already doubled um, for a one, the same amount of money. Mm -hmm. So you know, your money that is going from the saving account on high interest saving account probably just covered the same what you're buying today. Yeah. Yeah, maybe even less. Like looking at grocery, our grocery bill, it's, it's going higher, and higher. higher and higher, and the total amount. Um, that we spend is higher, but the volume of product that we're getting from the supermarket is getting smaller. Less. And smaller. Yes. So, so not that we're saying you should just send the money out to spend. No. 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 Not to spend at all. Is to put it somewhere can earn even higher than five percent return. Um, historically, ETF can earn like what depends on which one seven percent which... minimum. Yeah, I looked at our. At the past 12 months data, um, on an average, our earnings is about 10%. No, but average. your calculation is including capital. Yeah, that's including capital. Yeah, your, so your calculation is not right. So, <laughs> yeah, that's right. Now, my one's including capital. So yes. It's not only that their capital, it's, I don't know, maybe about 7 mm or -hmm. 8% from our money. Yeah, because ours, we keep putting money in every single month minimum. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. it's very hard for us to calculate. So, that's just our two cents. So, High interest saving account, it's great starting point as a <laughs> a newbie learning. Not to put the money in the pillow. <laughs> underneath yeah, the pillow. compared to mm. earning it under the pillow. It's like having the concept of, hey, um, my money is earning more money. Mm -hmm. That's the starting point. Yeah. Like it's great. Um, it, you, it, maybe like for one year. And then you might consider doing other things. Definitely. Yes, and you may find you may want to find somewhere. How? Where can I look for um, product can earn more interest there you or go. dividends? So that's just our two cents, guys. Um, if you like this type of content, don't forget to subscribe, comment. See you next time. Bye. Bye. Seven minutes only.